Hello, welcome to warservice.net video tutorials. Today we're going to take a look at how to upgrade your bucket. Uh, basically, a lot of people are having problems because War Service automatically installs the latest um, stable release of bucket. And uh, if you're running, let's take this for example, this server is running 1.1, which is the latest stable release uh, at the time of recording. But Minecraft 1.2.3 is out, so it's not going to work when you connect as you can see so to do this what you need to do is go into your server manager stop the server go into file manager and then go to bucket.org in the tab what you're going to do is click recommended build for craft bucket this is 1.1 but if you want to uh, have your own version you can so as you can see Minecraft 1.2.3 this is the revision 3 you're going to click the number just there and as you can see it's red this is because it's not a stable release and it's really not recommended but anyway what you want to do is just copy this link here come into here upload file URL to file and just copy the file in full full URL and then click upload this will download get the server to download the file from bucket straight away instead of you having to download it and then upload it yourself now as you can see there's a new file here called graphbucket-dev and there's a file here called war servers graphbucket-war servers now this is the new version this is the old version that comes with it this is 1.1 this is 1.2.3 what we want to do is change that file to that file so what we're going to do is copy that name we're actually going to remove that old craftbucket-warservers.jar now we have just craftbucket.jar if we try and start the server it won't actually find uh, it won't start because we don't have that named to our craftbucket-warservers so we're going to paste that straight in there and rename it from dev to warservers.jar hit rename, hit ok, display, start take a few seconds and as you can see we've stopped it here and now we're starting it so it's coming up now paste that in and there you go we're logged in and now we're able to play awesome game which is minecraft so that's how you update your bucket to the latest version or whatever version you want on your server